Good morning, friends and dear students. It gives me immense pleasure to be here again for my course, Flight Mechanics. I am in the process of learning the air safety today. My topic is air safety. In this, I am Dr. Vaidhi Dubedi, Professor IARE Hyderabad, India, from Department of Aeronautical Engineering. Today's topic, I am going to discuss about aviation safety, statistics of accidents, accident topology, transport comparison, aviation safety hazards, runway safety, and the terrorism. I will talk about aviation safety. Aviation safety means the state of an aviation system or organization in which risk associated with aviation activities related to or in direct support of the operation of the aircrafts are reduced and controlled to an acceptable limit. So when we talk about aviation safety, our intention is to make sure that there should not happen any accident, there should not be any threat for the materials man on the property. It is not only the man, it is your aircraft, your airport, your land, your people's, other people who are nearby, they also should be safe. So aviation safety means the state of an aviation system or organization in which risk associated with aviation activities related to or in direct support of the operation of aircraft are reduced and controlled to an acceptable limit. We cannot make zero, but surely we should try to make as minimum as possible. It encompasses theory, practices, investigation and categorization of a flight failure. The prevention of such failure through regulation, education and the training. So we have to prevent by educating the people, making the laws and also we, we have to give the training to the people so that the aviation safety is maintained. Statistics of the accident. So we will see how much accident are happening and we can see here that as we are going to the latest one, it is old data from 2012 to 2016. So if you see here, accidents are tremendously here, three, then here, if you see here, it is 2.5. So like this per million departure, these many accidents are happened. If you see here, the fatalities per million revenue, passenger in kilometers 1970 to 2018. So here it was very big. Now it is very, very less. So your uh, deaths are tremendously reduced as we are passing and it is happening due to the rigorous training, due to the awareness, all the concerned people has to be aware about the system, about the flight safety and other issues. And here, yearly fatalities since 1942, five years average in the red and peak in the 90s. In the 1972, it was happening like this, but now it is not so. Accident topology. Runway safety represents 36% of the accident. Ground safety 18% and loss of control is 16%. So it is the how many percentage of the different issues are taking part and who are uh, so 36% by the runway very very high then the ground safety if you add this it is going to 54% and the loss of the control is 16% these all parameters are here given runway safety then uh, ground safety loss of control then operational damage injury others unknown and control flight into the terrain. So here, this is the pie chart for different uh, types of accident. If you see the blue, that is the runway is very important. And then we have the ground safety, the second one. And then we have the loss of the control. Then we have the operational. Then we have here injury. So like this, different uh, types of problems but if you see 36% is very very and it is happening due to the runways issue 
runway safety issues. The main cause, the main cause is pilot in command error. Safety has improved from better aircraft design process, engineering and maintenance, and evaluation of navigation aids and the safety protocol and the procedure. So most of the accidents are happening due to the pilot's misjudgment or some intentionally error and this has improved day by day. Transport comparison, if we compare the different types of the transport for the death per million, buses are 4.3, then rail are 20, van 20, car 40, food 40, water 90, air is 117, pedal cycle is very very high. Okay, skydiving, motorcycle, space shuttle and if you see per hour, if you see the air, per kilometer it is very very less, 0 0.05, this is the statics, means if you see the per kilometer it is 0 0.05, comparing to this one is uh, very high food. The people who are walking on the road and street, they are getting more damage and this motorcycle are also very high. So motorcycle uh, per kilometer 108 people are dying. So if you see our uh, aircraft flight is very very safe comparing to other modes, if you see per billion of the statistics. Air safety hazard, foreign object debris, these are the debris which are found on the aircraft, which are not necessary and th they are put on the aircraft, misleading information and lack of information, lightning, there is some lightning from the cloud, it, it is happening, ice and the snow, the different types of weather condition, they are also making the problems. Wind shear and the micro bust. A wind shear. So, first thing is the wind shear. So, so many accidents are happening due to the wind shear. And uh, as you can see here, the diagram is also there. So, a wind shear is a change in wind speed and or direction over a relatively short distance in the atmosphere. A micro bust is a localized column of sinking air that's dropped down in a thunderstorm. So it is a sinus, unsinus, ice crystals here and here if you see it is illustration of the micro bust. They are the micro, all of a sudden a huge amount of water is falling. It is called the micro bust, wind shear or the micro bust. Engine failure also the reason Structural failure of the aircraft, stalling of the aircraft, fire, bird strike, human factor, piloting while intoxicated. If you are piloting with the drugs or some alcohol, other human factors, controlling flight into the terrain, electromagnetic interference, ground damage, volcanic ash. So these are the few factors which are affecting the aircraft. Flight safety, human factor size is very, very important if you are able to control and flight terrain like hilly or any other terrain that different types of winds are, some electron, electromagnetic interferences will make your instruments not working properly that time also. Engine may fail due to some technical error, bird hit and some other issues structural failure of the aircraft due to the over speeding due to the some other issues stalling may happen during landing or during the takeoff fire may take place body strikes are very and human factors are very important so accidents if you see here human factor environment and the machine so we should be in this this is the accident zone where all the three are matching And your mind should be very peaceful while you are working on the aircraft, you are flying on the aircraft, you are on the ground, you are ATC, wherever in the airfield, your mind should be very much 
peaceful. It should not be in tension. It should not be in the problem. Human factor in flight safety, it is a very, very important factor because everywhere humans are involved. So, airplane loads, fatigue, flutter, corrosion, maneuvering limits, stability and stall. Airplane system, if you talk about flight control, hydraulics, electrical systems, pneumatic systems, fire protection systems, navigation, communication and flight deck, propulsion systems, your engine, engine control, then reverses fuel system. If you talk about the ground, air traffic control systems, radar, radios, instruments, landing system, control, computers and the displays, maintenance facilities and equipments, fueling facilities, dispatch, planning facilities. So these all are the very important here environmental factor, design and the manufacturing factor, this all things coming and if you talk about the environmental factor, here is the wind, turbulence, gust, microburst, rain, then sleet, hail, icing, clouds and the forecasting rain, visibility, these all are the awareness and the addition. Then it is the flight crew, awareness and attention, adherence to the procedure, embedded skills, coordination activities, fatigue and training, air traffic control, awareness and the attention, adherence to the procedures and the fatigue, maintenance and the dispatch, adherence to the procedure, quality of the work, etc. If you talk about the runway safety, types of runway safety incidents includes runway excursion and accident involving only a single aircraft making an inappropriate exit from the runway. Runway overrun, a specific type of excursion where the aircraft does not stop before the end of the runway. So if it is not stepping at the end of the runway, it will cross the runway and there will be some accident. This you can see here, these accidents are uh, shown here. Runway incurs on incorrect presence of the vehicle, person or another aircraft on the runway. That is called uh, Tenerife aircraft disaster. Runway confusion. Oh, sometimes you may land in the another runway. Crew misidentified the runway for landing or takeoff and these some accidents are shown here which are oh, happened in the past. Then terrorism is also very much problem for the aircraft safety. So in this we need the military action. Passenger planes have rarely been attacked in both peacetime and the war. Examples in 1955 Bulgaria shot down L flight 402. In 1973 Israel shot down the Libyan Arab Airlines flight number 114. 1983, the Soviet Union shot down the Korean Airlines flight 007. 1988, the 88 United States shot down the A Iran Air flight 655. In 2001, the Ukrainian Air Force accidentally shot down the Siberian Airline flight 1812 during an exercise. In 2014, R Russian Air Airspace Defense Force Buck missile uh, system shot down the Malaysian airline flight 17. So these are the some regulators of the aviation that is Director General of Civil Aviation for India, Civil Aviation Authority for UK, CAA, Department of Infrastructure, Transport and the Regional Development and the Local Government for the Australia. European Aviation Safety Agency, ESA, Federal Aviation Administration, that is FAA, Irish Aviation Authority, Transport Canada. These are the few regulator. Every country has its own regulator, but uh, there is ICAO, which is the international under the UNO. Safety Improvement Initiative, 
the safety improvement initiative or aviation safety partnership between regulators manufacturers operators professional unions research organization and international aviation organization to further enhance safety some major safety initiative worldwide or commercial aviation safety team in the us cast was founded in 1998 with a goal to reduce the commercial aviation fatality rate in the usa for 80% to 2007 european strategic safety initiative the essi is an aviation safety partnership between isha other regulators and the industry the initiative objective is to further enhance safety for citizen in europe and worldwide through safety analysis implementation of cost effective action plan and coordination with other safety initiative worldwide air safety procedures here we have different air safety procedures are there showing safety severe safety procedures to vector stock in safety in flight safety procedure this you can see during the flight your air crew are demonstrating some charts air stewards explains the safety alarm and other things flight safety cards by the jack tribal safety instruction placard aeroflot airline and steward explanation so in the ne next topic we will be discussing about fuel reserve in aircraft fuel planning taxi and the trip fuel in flight fuel management procedure if fuel less dumping of fuel and the tank location fuel calculation flight planning these are the references which i have taken from anderson jd aircraft performance and design international edition micra hills for first edition sl by me aircraft performance theory and practice aia education series any questions you are welcome to ask my email id is yd dwedi d w i v e d i at the rate gmail.com this is the my email please do like and subscribe this channel if anywhere i have i might have done some mistake please do pardon me and write in comment or you can write in my this email till then goodbye thank you very much for the joining my class like share and subscribe hit the bell icon for more updates